Hello and welcome, my fellow Lumineers. It is Wonder Name Guy, and yes, I have Maui out. Today is Lorcana. I have a little something extra here for the end of the video. Go through this pretty quick. This is the last, um, not the last, the uh, Sapphire and Steel are the last, but this is the last uh, deck that I have yet to open. Um, out of the first chapter. I've also opened both uh, decks for the Floodborne, but did that off camera with a buddy. Um, let me try and open this. This one's already like pretty bent up. Like that's open and that. And then I got a pack. Got this at big chain store, so. But, I mean, look how easy, look how easy that was. <laughs> Just, yeah. So this one is Emerald and Ruby. I'm gonna go ahead and I'll pop these out later, but this, this, I mean obviously this, but these, the playmat and, you know, the instructions on how to play the game, pretty, cr pretty crucial part to <laughs> the game. Anyway, so here's that deck, I'm gonna open that after I open these two packs, let's get into it. Hope everyone is having fun and able to play some actual games at their local game stores, their local the LGSs, local game stores. Um, oh, we got a foot. <laughs> uh, I know organized play isn't a thing yet, which, you know, two sets in. Yeah, that's its own, uh, that's its own conversation. Uh, one that I do want to have. Um, just trying to track down product to, oh wow, Moana, 526. This is not who you are. When you play this character, you may banish chosen character named Taka. Oh, okay. I thought that was a Mulan card. Reflection. Top, look at the top three cards. Put back on top in any order. There we go. We got top. <laughs> is this little, the guy, the little guy? Ooh, Sword of Truth, haven't seen that yet. Uh, banish this item. Banish a villain, there we go. Oh, yay, Musketeer Tyranid. Tar, tar bed? Trying to build a uh, Musketeer thing. Oh, wow! <laughs> out of a, out of a starter. Yeah, alternate art, there we go. Woo! <laughs> and Hades no less, that is awesome. Oh, that is definitely going into a deck right there. Do I have any sleeves on hand? I do. Yes, I do. Any perfect fit? I don't have the perfect fit on hand. Oh wait, yes I do. I didn't think I was gonna pull something. Wowie wow whoa. <laughs> there we go. So we got perfect fit. Okay, then we got regular sleeve okay this one is actually an oversized you can see that so this bad boy is getting tripled and no wait he is going to get <laughs> four four sleeves four <laughs> that is awesome oh <laughs> We just end the video right there. <laughs> I saw something shiny back there, but I was like, okay, that's a foil, but wow. That is a foil indeed. Whee! Anyways, so these two cards are pretty good. Let's go back. I think it's one of every color. So that's kind of weird. You know, that is one of every color. Just the way that it was. Here we go. Amber. Amethyst. Amber, Amethyst, Emerald, Ruby, Sapphire, and then Steel. Although on promotional stuff, it's actually like Steel, Amber, Amethyst, and then Sapphire is the last one, so it's kind of weird. Then we had Moana, Reflection, Tomate, Sword of Truth, and... Musketeer, 
Tarban. Whenever one of your characters with bodyguard is banished, you may draw a card. There we go. Bodyguard is pretty pretty strong mechanic. Let's go through. Oh nope. Let's do this guy. Let's do this puppy. Pop that. Get the little wing. And there we go. Save this for promotional purposes. I gotta get a couple of other ones. I think I have I have the Mickey and Elsa. I need to get a Maleficent one. And then I don't know how many there are for Floodborne. I have a display and I'm trying to fill it out with, you know, empty promotional not promotional stuff, but just empty product. I'll show a picture of it. Um, I don't know, I'm not doing Instagram right now, so so, oh, wow, there we go. Two feet. <laughs> Two left feet. Two right foot? There we go. A little bit more familiar with the Floodborne cards because I actually got my hands on those when they were coming out. But that is just still... Uh... <laughs> uh, yeah, pick a fight. One of the better cards out there. Your uh, chosen character can challenge ready characters. That's pretty big. Banish chosen damage character for three, that's pretty big. It's uh, it's an action, not a song, but... Oh, Miss uh, Miss Judson? Haven't seen her. Mrs. Judson, 1-5. Whenever you play a Floodborne character, you may put top card of your deck into your inkwell. Yeah, see the blue just seems like it's... Just try to... Ooh, Yzma! <laughs> Shift for four. <coughs> Inkable, that's good. 4-4 four, four for 2. Uh, Cruel Irony. When you play this character, shuffle another chosen character into their player's deck. That player draws two cards. Wow. Ooh, foil flower. Yeah, see, that's what I thought it was, just, you know, like a foil. Because it was, like, kept popping out over there on the left. I was like, ah. We got foil. Uh, Yzma. This. Pick a fight, one of the better cards for steals. These, these. 1 5 and then Mr. Uh, uh, or 1 9 and then Bubbles is 5 9. It's like, geez. And they're both inkable. Just throw them in, throw them in your deck. If you don't want to use them, just ink them. <laughs> anyway, so let's go over what this deck had. There's the deck list if you want to pause. We're gonna go over it though. Uh, yeah, I just still can't believe I got that. <laughs> oh man, uh, that is awesome. Hades, grabbing my soul from the underworld. Yep, that is just awesome. What was that from? Yep, that's to keep in that pack definitely. This one, I have enough. Beast is my lucky. For Floodborne, maybe Elsa's my my luck for first chapter. That's how I used to draw stuff from Magic: The Gathering. They they used to have different arts for stuff, but since they've been doing the draft and set packs, they haven't. Anyways, uh, Aladdin, Cruella de Vil, uh, another Aladdin. Duke, the wrong Duke. Horus, Iago, Jasper, really great card, underutilized card. Mad Hatter. I'm trying to keep the video short, so I'm not going to go over too much. I will make a longer video on Lorcana, I promise. That's also a good card. It's a song. Can't ink it, but you can tap creatures for it. That's another great one. This is a good one, too. Those are all those greens. There's Aladdin. This is a great card as well. Try to make it under 10 min minutes. Lafo, that's a great card. Pongo, great cards. Run through this super fast. Pretty much, you know, there, there's that stitch. Banish, there we go. You get three in here. Jeez. It is an action, not a song. And then, Shield of Virtue. Oh my jeez, sorry I blew through that. I... <laughs> yes. Something good on camera. That's just great. Hope everyone has been having fun, and like I said, have enough product to be playing with at least your own local playgroup. Hopefully, January, end of January, February, we'll have some organized play info. 
until then, may the ink well serve you well. I gotta come up with a better end. <laughs> and in quote for that, but yeah, may the, uh, um, uh, may the ink well flow. There we go. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by.